Hey everybody, it's Evan here for Method and today I'm going to show you a trick in Photoshop for when you scan in a sketch or an image to straighten it out the fastest, easiest way. And so uh, it's a little bit of a departure from our normal 3D work, but this is a huge time saver. You know, a lot of times in architecture we're sketching in a sketchbook or on some trace and we don't always sketch uh, perpendicular to the edges of the sheet. And uh, then when we scan it in and we put it on a scanner, we don't always get it straight in the scanner or in this case I'm going to show you here um, let's jump into Photoshop I've got this image that's in my sketchbook and uh, I took the picture with the camera a little bit rotated the wrong way alright so no big deal I'm going to show you how to straighten this stuff out in Photoshop very quickly um, because this normally could be a pretty tedious job if you're doing it kind of the old-fashioned way which is going up under the edit menu and we're going, or sorry, image menu, image rotation, arbitrary, and then trying to find, you know, the right degrees, so five degrees clockwise, and is that right or is it not? You know, that's kind of tedious. So I'm going to show you the fast way to do this. And uh, actually, I'll show you two fast ways to do this. The first thing is, um, what we're going to do is just get the image a little bit closer to what we want. So I'm going to rotate it 90 degrees counterclockwise. And then I use the command plus and minus keys a lot in Photoshop. I'm a huge fan of keyboard shortcuts and uh, whenever I can learn them. So I'm going to zoom in and find a line that's supposed to be straight. And what you want to do is you want to find the measure tool, which in this case, in this version of Photoshop, it's the fifth icon down. It's under the eyedropper tool. And the ruler tool allows us to measure things on the screen, right? So I'm going to measure out this which I'm picking a straight line in my sketch alright and so in this case I'm picking a horizontal line and uh, normally you know if you look up here in our info bar that tells us how long that line is it also tells us the angle of that line which is pretty cool um, but let's who cares what that is if you go to image image rotation arbitrary it automatically fills in exactly the angle that that is and you can hit OK and it just rotates it so it straightens it out. All right, so that's a big time saver. Now the other way to do it, let me undo, is if I go back to that ruler tool, and in this version of Photoshop, again, it depends which version you have. They keep adding stuff to help things uh, move along quicker. They just add a straighten button right up here in the top. And so if you click that, it will straighten and crop the image all at the same time. And if I zoom out, you'll see that the image doesn't have any um, bad boundaries or anything. It just crops it in as tight as it can based on that rotation. And that's it. That's how you get these images straight for underlaying it under your 3D model. Now if you wanted to build on top of that or drop this into a booklet and, uh, and get that diagram into your presentation. Alright, so that's it for this MethodCast Quickie. I will see you on the next one. Bye.